Well, after 20 years and 250 wins, Dale Mueller calls it quits as Highland High School's head football coach. He will run the athletic department and also teach at Highlands for one more year. But he's leaving the team he led to 11 state football championships. Why is he leaving? Local 12 News reporter Joe Webb talked with the coach today and has the story. It's hard to believe the flags at Highlands High School aren't at half staff today. Saturday, they narrowly lost a bid for a seventh straight Kentucky 4A football championship. Monday, they lost the coach who'd led them to 11 state titles. 59-year-old Dale Mueller knows a lot about clock management. He says this decision was about time, a decision to start revolving his time around his families instead of them revolving their time around him. Both daughters got married in the middle of the dead period because that's when it worked best for dad in football. And if you, when we have Thanksgiving dinner, we're going to have it early in the day because dad's got football practice that night. Dale Mueller says he's ready for some free time. There's no doubt he spent his time well coaching at Highlands. His 20 years is a steady stream of wins, championships, and players who've gone on to play at all levels of college football and the NFL. He can't pick a favorite win or a favorite moment in his career, but he can quickly name his favorite player, his son Eamon, a bluebird running back who is the undisputed number one. I'd say there's a lot of guys that tie for second, though. Most people think of Dale Mueller as a football guy, and he's definitely that, but he's a lot more than that. Mueller has an engineering degree from Cornell. When he's not winning football titles, Dale Mueller teaches chemistry and AP physics at Highlands. He will continue to do that for another year and will serve as the school's athletic director. He says the first day of weight training next season will be the hardest for him. He says he'll miss being there with the guys, because for Dale Mueller, winning is more about relationships than X's and O's. I think probably the biggest thing that made me a successful football coach was I liked the guys and they knew it uh, and they liked me and we liked being a part of a team together and uh, because we liked each other and we were part of a team we tried hard uh, trying hard pays off. It sure did and now it's time to try hard at something else. In Fort Thomas, Joe Webb Local 12 News. What a great guy. Dale Mueller played football at Highlands. After graduating from Cornell, he worked as a mechanical engineer for several years before becoming a teacher and a coach. Mueller was the head football coach at Withrow and Sycamore before coming to Highlands in 1994. And I was lucky enough to get to cover him back yeah, when I sure. did sports years ago. One of my favorite stories was when he was coaching at Withrow and their offensive line averaged like the players average weight was 350 so Dale and I went to lunch and we sat there and had lunch with the offensive line and these guys could eat and yes. we just laughed and we had more fun he's I, just such a neat guy I didn't know he was an engineer either we, I, I learned that honestly today. I didn't know that either until yeah, today good so. story from Joe yeah